Hello, this is APAD TV Admin, and this is part two of the Yugo's UT3 RK3288 uh, preview. Um, we're going to test out some video, and uh, first we'll check out the online video. Now, on the, the Yugo's UT3, you've got two types of launcher pre installed. One's like what we're looking at now, it's a uh, You've got uh, categories, online TV categories. Now, these links open up uh, Chinese streaming TV apps. But now on these uh, Chinese TV stream streaming TV apps, you've got uh, lots of uh, English content as well. So if we, for example, if we click on movies, you've got a large selection of movies to choose from, all different categories. You can just click through if you can't understand Chinese. It's, it's very simple to use still. Um, now normally you'd be controlling this with uh, the remote control, the UT3 remote control, but uh, we don't have that yet because uh, you know this unit's not even cased. It's just the board. So uh, I'm using a USB keyboard and I can use the cursor keys, the arrow keys to, to just go through and click different things. So, we can continue going down, there's another page of films and another page. And this is just the films category. There's um, there's lots in the, the online TV category as well, TV shows. But um, let's just scroll through. I mean, there's, there's quite a few pages. Yeah, look at this one, I haven't seen this before. So just press enter and it plays it. Now we're only on a, an 8 -bit. I can use the volume control on the keyboard to adjust the volume. Same as you would do with the remote control. The device is set at 1080p at the moment. The streaming uh, media that's being streamed is probably 720p, I think. It, look, it does look pretty crisp and pretty good for instant streaming. And it's fluid and... Uh, Take the sound down because uh, YouTube might flag the video. But uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's a good little streaming TV app there and uh, it's pre installed. And, uh, and you can rate the video at the end of it when you've finished viewing it. And anyway, that's, that's the, the movie TV app. You've got also got a, a music app. That's in Chinese and uh, it might be a little bit more difficult to navigate compared to the TV apps. The TV, movie, documentary, variety, and the children's shows, and the news is uh, very easy to use, and you, you won't really need Chinese to be able to, to, be able to use those, so uh, they're pretty straightforward. The music might take a bit more uh, sussing out. You've got a, a recommended category here as well, and with this you can scroll through, and there's just a few shows recommended. We'll click on a few, mostly Chinese TV shows. Category which we've already seen, and there's online TV which is just a selection of shows, and there's, there's no others there. Then we've got the inbuilt apps, we've got Wi Fi display, browse on all the obvious apps you'd expect. There's another music uh, app there for playing music that's resident on the device, not streaming. There's a, there's a separate app store. It's uh, different to Play Store, we can open that. I haven't checked this out. Okay. Might be the internet connection. We've got all apps. There's a game controller set up, an air mouse utility. Device service, it's another air mouse service, help you set up your air mouse. Okay, in settings you've got Wi-Fi. We're on Ethernet at the moment just because it's there's an Ethernet connection there for the board, so Wi-Fi works great, I've used that as well. Okay. We've got a lot of different options, USB for connecting to the to the computer for OTG function. We've got display, you've got different output interfaces, HDMI, component video or TV. We're on HDMI at the moment. And you've got HDMI mode. And you can set the resolution and the, the screen refresh rate. 
we've got it on 50 at the moment, we, we can go to 60, it doesn't really make any difference on this setup. Okay, there we go. There's also a, a printing facility on this, this is KitKat. I haven't seen printing on any other versions of Android before. Okay, screen scale, so we can uh, adjust where the edges are. There's the settings menu anyway. And, uh, at the moment, I'm just copying over a 14.5 gig uh, DTS movie file, and we're going to give that a test. It's, it's only a 1080p uh, movie because this this Sony TV is not 4K, so we can't test 4K today. But um, we, we can give it a, a little one for its money on this uh, 14K file. Anyway, let's uh, let's copy that over now, and I'll uh, I'll start shooting the game. 